you want to level up your perspective game, but you don't even know where to start and where to put your windshield lines, don't panic. You can start super easy and Clip Studio Paint is helping you. First, you need a rough idea what kind of perspective you want. Maybe there's a table in the middle of the room you want, and you can just like simply put it down like this. Now you want to go to layer, new layer, 3D layer, and you got this little grid over here, which you can move around and adjust to the perspective of the little cube you've drawn. Now, when you go to your layers, you see this here, this is your 3D layer. And when you click on this little X here, you open up the perspective grid. Now you can create a new layer on top and the lines you draw now will be snapped to this perspective grid. For this to work, make sure those are activated. You can turn off and on this perspective grid as you need it. And even more important, you can click on it and move things around. You can see how the perspective lines work, where your banishing lines will be, and you can move them around and change them and see what will this do to your perspective. And this will give you a first idea of how a perspective grid could look like, how it will work like, and gives you an understanding. Or just use it as it is. Draw your rooms like this, draw your items like this. Have just fun with the perspective grid, figure out how things work, how it looks like, and just play around a little bit with perspective and have fun.